Welcome back on this Tuesday morning. So some roads are likely going to be slippery and wet. There are a few roads that might have a very small, thin layer of some snow uh, from the snow that's kind of fallen through the region. This is M Elm River Township along M26, and you can see that there's some very minor snow accumulation there this morning. Otherwise, most areas are dealing with some of this drizzle mist and freezing drizzle mixing in with some of this very light lake effect snow that's quite spotty this morning. Here's the setup and what's happening. Here's the clipper system that's moving through the region. It's what uh, started to give us that wintry mixture during the overnight hours and yesterday, and we still have some of that very light. Now what happens is it's going to continue to track east and high pressure is going to be building in behind it rather quickly. Also going to be bringing in some drier air. This is the water vapor imagery. We have some drier air coming in out of the northern plains, so we're going to see a lot of this precip that we're seeing this morning quickly taper off or by early in the afternoon. It's not a lie. It, it's just enough to make for some slippery spots out there. Here's the satellite radar lipimetry. You can see that those few scattered snow showers that have been around overnight have been gradually tapering off this morning. Here's your hour by hour for today. We'll see that continue to come to an end. This is midday. The rest of the day is going to be cloudy with the wind flow out of the northwest. Speeds of around 15 miles per hour, gusts of around 20 to 25. This evening, the wind flow sh uh, changes and it becomes more southwesterly into tomorrow. And then the winds pick up a little bit more tomorrow. Tomorrow looks to be more on the breezy side for folks over into the Keweenaw. We could have some pockets of some sun, but generally some cloud cover for tomorrow. On Thursday, there's uh, another frontal boundary that's going to move through the region with some very light mix starting very late tomorrow night, extending into Thursday morning and a few spotty snow showers right around midday on Thursday. But otherwise, no big significant moisture or precipitation for us for the next several days or even extending through this weekend and early next week. So those few spotty rain showers that might be around today, early this morning, and then again on Thursday, quite minimal, less than half of an inch likely out of those. Our high temperatures for today topping off in the mid 30s as we look towards tomorrow really unseasonably warm tapping into the mid 40s, especially for our western counties of the EP and upper 30s right along Lake Michigan and the east end. So tomorrow we are going to have temperatures easily top off about 20, maybe even 25 degrees above the normal. We had a record high in 1993 of 42 degrees for tomorrow at the local National Weather Service office, and we could be seeing some of our records being broken tomorrow with that big warm up that's coming. So again, breezy over into the Keweenaw tomorrow, unseasonably warm with the potential of breaking some records tomorrow, small spotty snow shower on Thursday back to 30s but still above normal extending all the way through next week. High pressure looks to come in for Friday extending into the weekend and overall that's going to give us a better chance for some sunshine and dry weather.